persons, 75 years and older, must stay at home, subject to exemptions that are to be specified. And this will take effect on the 25th day of March 2020 for 14 days. All public sector workers, 65 years and older, are to work from home, subject to specified exemptions. That will take effect on the 25th day of March 2020. Schools are to remain closed uh, from the ending of the last order to the end of the Easter term. Every person who entered Jamaica as at the 18th of March 2020 must be quarantined for a further 14 days after the initial seven days expired. For a period of 14 days, with effect from the 25th of March, gatherings in any place shall not exceed 10 persons. We are also seeking to establish uh, some facilities around the country. The public health infrastructure is divided into regional health authorities. There are four such regions, and we need to identify facilities, 600 rooms, um, and these rooms are rooms that have to have a bedroom with a bathroom. Okay, so it has to, so an individual can be relatively isolated or isolated. Uh, so we need 200 such rooms in Sarah, which is the, this region of Kingston, St. Andrew, St. Catherine, St. Thomas. We need a 200 in southern region, which is Manchester, Clarendon, and St. Elizabeth. 100 in Western, which is uh, Hanover, St. James, Trelawney, and Westmoreland. And 100 in Nera, which is St. Anne, Portland, and St. Mary. What we're looking for is a transition house, if you will, halfway house, if you want to term it that, that would allow them to be isolated, to give them appropriate care while they recover. The ban that was placed on the visits to infirmaries have now been moved from the original date, which was 14 days, to now 30 days. And the ban on new admissions have been pushed to 60 days. The ban on amusement license will be in force for an additional period. And also the opening and closing of markets, the hours will remain from 6 a.m. to 2 p.m. We have not forgotten, ladies and gentlemen, the outdoor poor, which number some 14,000 across the country, and especially with an age group of 60 and over. The Poor Relief Department will be distributing care packages to meet the needs of all these areas, and this program will last for a period of three months, commencing on March the 30th. Also, there is 3,000 students who falls under the portfolio of the Poor Relief Department that will receive lunch on a daily basis. With immediate effect, the local authorities will be providing care packages on a daily basis for all persons living on the streets across the country. We will provide facilities at our drop-in center and we will be providing for them over the next four to six weeks on a daily basis, a care package along with at least two meals on a daily basis.